friends welcome to our channel employed engineers today we are going to see most repeated questions in principles of communication engineering now let's see module wise marks distribution module 1 8 to 15 marks module 2 20 to 30 marks module 3 35 to 45 marks module 4 15 to 25 marks module 5 20 to 25 marks module 6 8 to 12 marks let's go let's see module number one four times repeated questions are first define or explain noise figure and noise factor it's come for five marks three times repeated questions is explain various types of noise affecting communication system it also comes for five marks Two times repeated questions are first what is compounding also differentiate a compounding and new compounding next explain any four types of internal noise let's see module number two three times repeated questions are first explain vestigial sideband and its application next dsb sc ssb sc modulation comparison of m dsb sc ssb and next question is quadrature amplitude modulation it may comes for 10 marks let's see module number three which is a jackpot four times repeated question are first explain the operation of foster sealer discriminator with the help of circuit diagram draw phasor diagram also writes its principal merits and demerits second write a short note on amplitude limiting and thresholding Next question is explain indirect FM transmitter with suitable diagram. Next, pre emphasis and de emphasis its needs and applications. Next, why FM is immune to noise. Next, what are drawbacks of delta modulation, diagram, and waveforms? Next, explain adaptive delta modulation in detail. Next, application of pulse and frequency modulation. It comes for 5 marks. Now let's see module number 4 5 times repeated questions are first why AJC is required in radio receivers second question is double sporting and fidelity of radio receivers it may come for 5 marks 4 time repeated question is explain super hydrodyne receivers also draw its block diagram and explain its working Three times repeated question is explain selectivity and sensitivity. It may comes for five marks. Let's see module number five. Five times repeated question is state and prove sampling theorem for low pass band limited signals. It comes for ten marks. Three times repeated questions are what is aliasing and how it can be prevented. Next, explain aliasing error and aperture effect two times repeated question is difference between natural sampling flat sampling and top sampling it may come for five marks now let's see module number six four time repeated question is explain tdm and fdm in detail it come for five marks three times repeated question is Explain signal multiplexing in detail. It comes for 5 marks. 